Welcome back Forex, Crypto and Stock Market Trader, to Lesson 2 of Short-Term Trading March 2017 ICT Mentorship Private Core Content. This free trading lecture provide from the Free Trading Academy TradingStrategicorsa.com is defining the weekly range profiles. Before we get into this let me preface it by saying this is one of the lessons that if you just look through it quickly and not paying much attention to it it's going to look rather, uh, ambiguous it's going to seem unfruitful but its impact is shown and solidified really by you going through price data and seeing these profiles unfold in hindsight seeing how they operate how. Short Term Trading, Defining Weekly Range Profiles Short Term Trading particularly in the context of weekly range profiles, involves the analysis of price movements within a defined weekly time frame. This approach focuses on identifying the high, low, and average range that a financial instrument, like a stock or currency pair, traverses over the course of a week. Traders using this strategy scrutinize these weekly range profiles to pinpoint potential entry and exit points, gauge market sentiment, and anticipate future price movements. This technique is especially relevant in volatile markets where short-term fluctuations can provide significant trading opportunities. In the Forex market, Tuesdays often unfold with a characteristic bullish profile. This tendency is observed when prices, initially positioned above a higher timeframe discount array on Monday, take a downward turn into the same array on Tuesday, marking the week's lowest point. Traders can anticipate this movement by closely monitoring these discount arrays. If the market doesn't venture into these arrays as expected, there's a strong possibility of a downward trend emerging, particularly during the London or New York sessions on Tuesday. The bearish turn of Tuesdays, highs and lows. Conversely, a bearish trend is typically anticipated when prices, initially below a higher time frame premium array on Monday, climb into this array on Tuesday, indicating the week's peak. This pattern can be forecasted by understanding the higher time frame premium arrays. Should the market not ascend into these arrays, traders might expect an upward drive, especially during Tuesday's key trading hours. Additionally, it's crucial to note that the highest point reached during the London session might be surpassed later in the week, contributing to this bearish trend. Wednesday's market forecast, identifying lows. Shifting focus to Wednesday, a bullish market sentiment is generally expected. This is evident when prices stay above the higher time frame discount array for both Monday and Tuesday, then drop into it on Wednesday, establishing the week's low. Traders should be alert to this potential drop, especially during the London and New York sessions on Wednesday. It's also worth noting that Monday and Tuesday might exhibit downward trends as well, setting the stage for Wednesday's low. Predicting Wednesday's high in a bearish market. In a bearish market scenario, Wednesday's high can be predicted when prices, after lingering below the higher time frame premium array at the start of the week, rise into it by Wednesday. This rise often signifies the highest point of the week. Traders can enhance their strategies by tracking these premium arrays and being mindful of the market's reaction to them. It's important to remember that the high reached during London session on Wednesday may be exceeded in the New York session, further defining the bearish profile of the week. The strategy of consolidation Thursday reversal. Approaching the latter part of the week, Thursday presents a unique opportunity in a generally bullish market. This day is characterized by a consolidation phase from Monday to Wednesday, followed by a sharp decline to the intraweek low, and then a subsequent market reversal. To effectively capitalize on this trend, traders need to be familiar with the higher time frame discount arrays and watch for signs of a downward drive, particularly around major market news or rate releases in the late New York session. Midweek Consolidation and Rally Dynamics In a bullish market, midweek consolidation from Monday to Wednesday is crucial, followed by a push to the week's highest point, expanding into Friday. This pattern is observable when the market, already bullish, has not yet reached the premium array on higher time frames but has rallied from a discount array without any bearish reversal indications. This lack of bearish reversal suggests an impending expansion towards the premium array. Midweek decline, navigating bearish markets. Conversely, in a bearish market, the pattern to anticipate involves consolidation early in the week, followed by a drop to the week's low, which then extends into Friday. 
This can be expected when the market hasn't reached the discount array on higher time frames but has recently declined from a premium array and paused without bullish reversal signals, indicating a potential expansion towards the discount array. Seek and destroy bullish Friday strategy. A neutral or low probability market profile typically emerges on Fridays, known as the seek and destroy bull ish pattern. Here, the price consolidates from Monday through Thursday, running shallow stops both under and above the week's initial highs and lows. The defining moment occurs when the price runs the intraweek high and expands further into Friday. This pattern often unfolds in anticipation of interest rate announcements or non-farm payroll data, especially in the summer months of July and August. Navigating Seek and Destroy Bearish Fridays in Forex Markets In the Forex landscape, Fridays present a unique Seek and Destroy Bearish profile, typically carrying neutral or low probability implications. This pattern manifests as price consolidation from Monday to Thursday, with minor fluctuations around the entry week highs and lows. The decisive movement occurs when the price hits the intraweek low and then descends further into Friday. Traders should be particularly vigilant when this pattern coincides with interest rate announcements or non-farm payroll releases, especially during the volatile summer months of July and August. In such scenarios, it's often advisable to exercise caution or even abstain from trading due to unpredictable market responses. Wednesday's Bullish Weekly Reversal Strategy Midweek, particularly on Wednesday, a bullish market profile is often anticipated. Key indicators for this trend include price consolidation on Monday and Tuesday, followed by a downward move into a higher timeframe discount array, prompting the activation of sell stops before a strong reversal occurs. This bullish reversal can be predicted when the market is hovering around long-term or intermediate-term low prices, pairing institutional buying with pending sell-side liquidity, traditionally known as sell stops. Identifying bearish reversal on Wednesdays On the flip side, a bearish reversal on Wednesday is typically marked by early-week price consolidation, followed by an upward drive into a higher time frame premium array, leading to the triggering of buy stops before a significant reversal. This trend is more likely when the market is at a long-term or intermediate-term high, aligning institutional selling with pending buy-side liquidity, or buy stops. Analyzing Forex Market Patterns for Effective Trading To truly grasp the nuances of these market patterns, traders are encouraged to meticulously analyze price actions on a one-hour chart, examining various pairs and time segments. By breaking down and defining these movements, one can identify recurring themes that often serve as precursors to specific market profiles. This analytical approach, coupled with insights from market maker templates and PD arrays, can significantly enhance trading strategies.